question 8 from a point on top of a cliff 40 meter high two boats a and b are observed due east the angle of depression of boat a is 32 and that of boat b is 52 degrees determine the distance between the two boats correct to two decimal places it is very important to sketch these so that you can be able to solve it easily so i'll begin by sketching so from a point on top of a cliff 40 meter high two boats a and b observed due east so due east at the angle of depression of boat a so let me start by drawing the cliff assuming that this is the cliff so there's a cliff and then this is the horizontal ground here so the angle of depression the angle of depression of boat a is 32 degrees the angle of depression get it from the top as you observe on top as you look downwards that is the angle of depression there's a difference between the angle of elevation the angle of depression the angle of elevation is when you are down somewhere on the lower side you are elevating your eyes you're looking upwards depression you're looking downwards so from the top here assume uh, these are we indicate the angle these are indicate so i'll draw a line here sorry So the angle of depression, this is A, this is the top, the cliff. So the angle of depression, we measure it like this, this is the angle. That angle is uh, 32 degrees. That will automatically give us this angle that is here. Look at this line. This line is parallel to this and this line is a transversal so that two is alternate to this angle that is here so this one will be 32 degrees that will be the angle of elevation from now a to the top of the cliff then for b the angle is 52 so 52 will be somewhere here so 52 degrees now this will be 52 so from here so this will be 52 degrees and again that angle is 52 this one is alternate and uh, this one also will be 52 is 90 degrees so the height of the cliff is 40 it is 40 meters now you're required to find the distance this is b so from the top of the cliff to b the angle of depression is 52 degrees having that right angle triangle here uh, you're supposed to determine the distance between the two boats correct to two decimal places the distance between so that is the distance b so this is the distance that is required so that is the distance so how do you go about this when you look at this diagram and this uh, right angle triangle uh, you can use uh, trigonometric ratios to get that distance and uh, the easier one looking at the side that you're given we can use tangent uh, there are two i can let this length this length from here indicate it so there's this uh, whole length here I can let that length be be let's say y and then there is this distance that is here. You can let this distance be represented by x. 
Now using that, we can use tangent uh, considering this uh, triangle that is here. Let's consider this triangle. So considering that triangle first, we can say tangent of 52 is equals to opposite side which is 40 over adjacent adjacent is x so this one will be able to give us x so x will be given by 40 divided by tan of 52 degrees working out this one using a calculator you get that 1.2 5 meters. You're giving the answers correct to decimal places. Then we have now the bigger triangle. The bigger triangle uh, with the base y. So we take this angle 32. So tan of 32 degrees is equals to the opposite side is still 40. But now the adjacent adjacent is y. The whole of that length is y. So this one will be able to get y. We make y the subject. Make y the subject. We're multiplying both sides by y and then dividing by tan that 2. So y will be given by 40 divided by tan 32 degrees. And this one, working out this using a calculator, you get... meters now we have these two lengths so we have this side which is uh, 64.01 and then we have this one is 31.25 now to get BA the distance BA we simply take the whole length which is uh, 64.01 then we subtract 31.25 5 we remain with that required length which is BA this one will give us 32.76 meters as simple as that